Hello everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for November 5th, 2021. AngelSouls444.com for personal readings, gumroad.com slash angelsouls for meditation challenges and other spiritual content. Let's see what we have going on for today. Oh, a big flip. Okay, what does that mean? A big flip. Let us see. Let us see what we have. Justice. Ooh. Okay, look out. Archangel Raguel. Fight for justice and equality. Rulings made in your favor. Don't give up. Uh, listen, this is righting the wrongs, but it's not done by you. It's done by the universe. So sometimes when justice is on deck, we hear the testimony, right? That's what I'm thinking. Like, we hear the testimony and you're like, I didn't know that. Wait, what? So there might be um, some information coming up that you're like, I didn't know that. But be careful not to get manipulated. You know, I have found myself in the most toxic situations where I end up apologizing to the other person. And then I go back and I'm like, why did I do that? Why did I just go? Because I'm trying to not escalate the situation. And that's not right. Okay. Let the universe do the correcting. You know the truth. You're going to get more of the truth. And it might not be what you want to hear, but it will, it'll help you feel more balanced. Okay. <sighs> Arguments being settled. Now, if you do actually have like a court case going on, it doesn't necessarily mean that it's all going <laughs> to stop today, but it just, they keep saying truth. There's like a balancing of truth. So you might get something like where like, I don't understand why this, that, and the other is going on or, oh man. Okay. Uh, I don't know how to put this. So if you know of, let's say a high profile person who has been harassing people, that could come out. Okay. That could come out. We've already been seeing it. There are already plenty of examples out there. But there's justice in that way too. If someone has harmed you and you're somebody who feels like you had to be scared quiet, um, it doesn't mean that you have to go stir things up if, if you don't feel like that's right. Or um, what I'm getting at here is if you don't feel like with the people you're dealing with that that's going to end well, get support. Of course, get support. But um, what this feels like, and I can't find the words. It feels like, you know, people are getting exposed. I mean, that's been happening. Um, but maybe something happened to you and you never spoke up. Uh, maybe you were afraid to, and it doesn't matter because they get exposed anyway. Uh, some of you may ha be in a situation where, okay, so many people have come forward. You know what happened to you too. And they're saying, okay, you know, anybody else can back up this story. And you say, okay, that happened to me as well. So for some of you, that that may not, obviously that's not going to be the case for everybody, but <sighs> things are balancing. Things are balancing. And this might also mean that if there was a narrative out there about you, um, I, I feel like uh, for some of you out there, there could have been like a community or something and you were blamed for something or um, you were seen in a certain way, subject of gossip, you know, that sort of thing. And then there's just the severe turn and it comes back, maybe comes back on some of the people, but more than that, it's like the light comes on and people see the truth and they realize, oh, oh, whoops, you know, like, oops. Uh, so, but again, for some of you out there, that might happen where you had your mind made up about something and then more truth comes to light and you realize you were wrong. Whatever it is, there's a balancing here. There is a balancing and um, it's going to help bring peace to the situation and it's going to help everybody move forward, <laughs> which I think is what a lot of people will want. So we're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.